Okay, folks, see that? That's $100 worth of line waving goodbye. Look at that. And you know what's on the end of here? A monster shark. <laughs> That's no redfish, fellas. What we did is we put out about a 10 inch mullet and that's all she wrote. I mean, you, I got big, you got way bigger arms than me. Too. I don't want to do I don't want to lose like all this line. That shit's gonna run right over him anyway. Yep. Watch this. Okay, see that ship, folks? He's gonna run right over the shark and our line. Oh, hey, he's turning. There he goes. He's strong, that he? ship is gonna run right over, unless he moves, the ship's gonna run right over him. This is gonna be something. He's either gonna move, or he's gonna see this thing coming at him. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Hey, yeah. Oh, see, it just parted right there. There it goes. Okay. See the spools? That's almost half gone. <laughs> That's almost half gone. Yep, and he finally broke it. Wouldn't that be shit if it got caught in its prop? It would take it off of here oh, so yeah, fast. It would, uh, it would, magic. It would yeah. probably pull the boat backwards for a second. We might actually have one, folks. We might actually have one. See, if the moons are aligned with Venus the way it's supposed to be, then it's supposed to be a group of them coming through, and that one will go off with the second one. We've had double headers a lot. I mean, because when they come through, it's usually a group of them. Who let them dogs out? Ooh, kind of going ahead of the boat here. You know the man who invents the iPhone that you can see in the sunlight? <laughs> He's the next billionaire. <laughs>